The quad at Texas State looks a bit different this semester. Like usually right now, this is just packed. There's all sorts of vendors on the side. Um, people are just passing from class to class. And like this year, there's like nothing. It's a departure from what Mason is used to, a practically empty campus and online classes. Right now they're all online, but I do have some classes after three weeks. They're going to be moving to in person. And that's what's been on his mind, especially classes that will have 100 or more students. A little scary to think about just all the people I'm going to come in contact with. While digital classes eliminate concerns over exposure to COVID, there's something else Mason is weighing. This is his final semester, and that means in-person classes might make his coursework easier to manage. In person, you know, the teachers usually like telling you, hey, don't forget this is due this day, this is due that day. But whenever it's online, if they're only putting up like um, pre-recorded slides or lectures like that, they can't really do that for you anymore. It's unclear how the rest of the semester might play out. It's like a lot harder to organize and prepare for classes sometimes, but got to work with what you have. For now, though, he says he'll be keeping a close eye on COVID rates on campus. If it like got really bad, then I would just stay there. I'd have to try to talk to my professors or something to see about like, not coming to in-person because I wouldn't want to do that. At Texas State University, Carlos Garcia, Spectrum News.